Oh, it's not working. I don't have to fix it. Nintendo was 80s gaming at its best. What? You think this is a game? One of my first memories is definitely playing Nintendo. Brady Grumbelt is still a kid at heart. A heart that loves gaming and solving technical issues. Technically. My brain automatically clicked into harmonica. And so I thought, uh, so I saw a game being blown out and I thought that was a harmonica. And I knew that it wasn't. It wasn't a harmonica yet. The second he picked up a Nintendo cartridge and played the first few notes of Mario, I was, I was hooked. Like that was just like a mind opening moment throwing me back 20 years. Blotendo uh, just came from uh, the idea of putting the, the harmonica in the cartridge from needing to, to blow out the system to, to get it to work. Blotendo's first product, the harmonic cartridge. We created this as close to the original Nintendo cartridge as possible. Uh, of course, the biggest difference is we've got our, uh, our harmonic cartridge hidden right in there. The look on people's faces when you first kind of show it to them and it just clicks in their head that it's, it's pretty funny. Got a lot of laughs off of that and a bunch of people asking for one. Their Kickstarter campaign was launched mostly to assess interest, but they hope to get the harmonic cartridge hitting all the right notes by Christmas. And the timing could be perfect. They're doing their 30 classic games on a mini little Nintendo, so it's coming back full force and it's one of those things that, uh, you know, it's, it's never gone away completely. And never will if Blotendo can help it. Desmolaika, CTV News, Edmonton.